There lived a young boy called Aladdin. One day a man met Aladdin in the street and asked him, Are you the son of Mustafa the tailor? He is my father, replied Aladdin. Did you know him? asked Aladdin. He was my brother, the man replied. Then you must be my uncle, said Aladdin. Yes, said the man. Now that I have found you, I want to help you and your mother. Here are some money for your mother, said Aladdin's uncle. Tell her I shall come to see her soon. The next day, the man who was an evil magician visited Aladdin's house and said to his mother, I left home a long time ago. Now that I have come back, I want to help you both. Aladdin's mother was taken in by magicians. All it done. My boy, would you like to earn some money? The man asked Aladdin. Oh, yes, sir. I would do anything to earn money, replied Aladdin. Taking permission from his mother, Aladdin set out. Soon they reached a desert place. The man spoke some magic words and a big safe opened. The magician gave Aladdin a magic ring to wear and said, Under this safe and bring me a wonderful lamp. The young boy, who was slim and agile, slipped through the opening and followed a few steps that led down into the safe. Going inside the safe, Aladdin looked all about him and found an old lamp lying on a chest. He took the lamp and slowly climbed back up the steps. Help me out! Create Aladdin. First, give me the lamp! shouted the man. Aladdin got suspicious. So he went back down the steps without answering. In his rage, the man pushed a heavy marble step over the entrance of the safe. Alone in the safe, Aladdin was frightened, terrible. He was in a darkness and drank his cold hands. He rubbed the ring given by the magician. Suddenly an amazing figure appeared before him. He was the genie of the ring. He helped Aladdin to reach home as soon as Aladdin's mother saw the old lamp. She began to wrap it clean. Suddenly the genie of the lamp appeared. He provided them with food and clothes. After some time, Aladdin married a princess. They started living in a magnificent palace, which the genie had built. One day, when the young princess was alone in the palace, a strange merchant stopped beneath her window. New lamps for old, new lamps for old, he created. The princess was unaware of Aladdin's secret and the existence of the genie. She found the old lamp and changed it for the new piece. The merchant was none other than the wicked magician. Having got the magic lamp, the wicked magician rubbed it. When Aladdin returned, he found the palace missing. Aladdin called the genie of the lamp, ordered him to take him to the princess. In a flash, he found himself of the stolen palace, his beautiful princess. Aladdin picked the lamp up and made the genie of the lamp appear again.
they return to the country sitting on the back of the genie.